cetera, et cetera. And th there's an old movie called Field of Dreams where it says, if you build it, you'll come. Uh, with Jesus, we say, if you live a life for Christ that demands an explanation, people will ask you why. And so um, th we started learning all these gardening techniques. Uh, Habitat came in, the city came in, a church came in, private owners came in, and donated all of this land that you see. Uh, you could pray about this plot. showcase area where um, we'll have a little aquaponics unit, uh, we'll have a caretaker's house which will provide for housing, which is another issue in the community, and under that we'll be able to process all of the goat's milk and uh, have a kitchen and things like that. So, a long story short, in two minutes, that's a little bit of the background of the neighborhood, why we're planting a farm. The other thing that we talked about is we're a discipleship ministry, and so uh, the way Paul talks about making disciples is he talks about his nurturing your own children. Disciples, and if there are children, their burdens become our burdens. And so we can't see people in hurting and in need without doing something about it. So when we saw a food desert, we said, well, we can do something about it. And we've got a dozen other stories uh, like that. Is Patrick, um, Patrick? He's with the goats. He's with the goats, okay. Um, we'd love for you to meet Patrick, talk with us here in Bon Ton. We've got other friends. So um, we're all about relationships, you know. So you're going to have a lot of projects today. But if you see some people from our neighborhood, please talk to them. We want you to get to know them love on them, let's talk, and uh, that's really the key. So if you didn't move a shovel but you developed relationships, that's what we would be uh, happy about. So um, I'm going to turn it over to Taylor for Second Saturday, and then I'll come back. <laughs> for all those who don't know who Second Saturday is, we serve every Second Saturday of the month all over West and South Dallas, and we've been with Bridge Builders now for almost two and a half years, from when the very first garden was put in to where we are now. And it's just a chance for us to come and uh, serve alongside them and then serve along the homeowners in the community that they can't really reach with home improvement projects. Um, so if you see anybody in orange shirt today, we're the ones who usually know what's going on. I hope you do. Um, if you have questions, ask us. I'm Patrick. Um, there's going to be